What is going on guys? Edward here for another WWE Supercard video and in today's episode we have news, updates, and of course Ring Domination Finale The Road to The Undertaker. So let's start off with uh, the news of course. Uh, so let's start out with Supercard news. In Supercard news on Monday we are getting an announcement of a special thing. Nobody knows what it could be. Uh, for the anniversary, they didn't do anything but announce that there's something coming on Monday. And we'll talk more about it on Monday. So we don't know if it's a new tier, new, new cards. Nobody really knows what it could be. So we're wait, we'll wait and find out and see what it, the fuss is about. Ooh, I just got an epic Stephanie McMahon. I won't claim it now. So Monday is the big day. Uh, I'll be at work, and pro probably they won't announce it until midday. So I guess that's kind of good because when I get out of work, it'll probably be around be like 9 a.m. in the Pacific. So I think I'll be able to be home when they announce it, which is a good thing. Uh, I like being home when they announce things instead of being at work. But either way, so Monday is the big Supercar News Day. Stay tuned for that. I'll have that live and post it for you guys. On that day, if you guys did not catch up on it. In uh, other news, I did purchase my brand new computer. Uh, it's not here for another two weeks, I believe. It's going to take a bit because it is from CyberPower. They're all the way in California. Uh, they're known for awesome computers, but they're also known for taking a long time in shipping. So... They don't w ship like on weekends. Like they don't. They haven't even built my PC yet. So it's. I ordered it on Friday, and that was like the probably the worst timing ever. But I finally got the cart in on Friday, so I ordered it on Friday. Customize it. It was fifteen hundred bucks, but I got most most of the stuff that I really really wanted from it. So I'm very happy with it. I'll be doing more videos and stuff. Uh, more games for the future to expand and more live streaming like twitch i will most likely be doing more twitch when i'm you know free from work of course maybe an hour or two i could do a day if i'm if i have the time or feel like the need to uh i could probably stream more events now with supers on my bbq so that'd be kind of cool so new computer is on the way just gonna take a two weeks but it has been ordered and i'm ecstatic to have it so yeah stay tuned for the rocket league shows we will have that first most likely for the with the new pc rocket league with super zone got bbq anyways guys uh this king of the ring i don't really care about it uh if i lose now i could care less uh this was just a fun little epic king of the ring that, that i decided to go for if i i want to lose in the finals i can get a ultra rare card I'll probably lose on purpose if I make it because I don't have any ultra rare cards for the next fusion chamber. So I need an ultra rare. Now, if you guys are wondering how I entered this, I entered it with two survivors, level zero, and then Bree was level zero. And now they're all maxed out. They're level 40s now, 45, whatever the hell it is. And uh, trust me, it's the best way to get epics. Uh, Ring domination, they level up your cards so well. I've only, like, I think I've energized once and then benched my people once. And that's it. So it wasn't stressful King of the Ring at all. But anyways, you guys are here for Ring Domination Undertaker. So we're almost done, as you can see. We have about four shards left. Uh, probably one or two games will do the trick. So that will pro them out 100%. I'm not going to be like, oh my god, barbecue. Who takes ten fucking cards and a lifetime to pro out a card? No offense, Zuma, I got BBQ. Alright, I might fuck that up. I'm not sure. Maybe. So let's see if I can get some wins here. Uh, we'll go at Randy Orton first. I didn't want to... Oh, shit. Well, thank God for his thing. Okay, it's time to boost up Randy Orton. Okay, he's not that bad. Sorry, I yawned. I was tired. I am tired. I'm going to sleep after this video is uploaded. Uh, I don't want to use it just yet. I will use this card for now. Alright, I figured he was going to do that. So we'll put Rock here, and then we should automatically win. 
That's all it takes with ring domination. Strategy and BS. Alright, so we're almost done with these shards. We, I think this might be the end right here. If I could pull this early. This will be the end. And we will be able to pro the Undertaker. Oh, we got it. I did pull a WrestleMania Ric Flair. Uh, yep, this will be... This is, this is it. Definitely it. Because I have five picks to go. And now we will end it right there with the Undertaker card. And another pick doubler. Wow, there's a lot of pick doublers. So what I might do is, I do have a day and 18 hours left. I might drop down to Legendary and get the Legendary. I do have 34 picks. And that is clearly enough. Uh, I only wasted 10 bucks, and I still have 35 left over. Which is basically Road to Glory. The same thing. Usually around Road to Glory, I have around 38 left when I finish the whole thing. So 35, it's the same thing. So averagely, you waste around 40 pick doublers per card. Well, has it been 40? Yeah, somewhere around 40, 45 per card, which is not bad at all. It's logical. Good. So I might go drop down because this is the rock. So, But the thing is, do I have the team for it? I got. That's what I got to figure out. But other than that, perfect. Perfect. So let's get into getting the Undertaker. All right, so we won game one. That's good. Now, what I plan to do is I'm giving them Roman Reigns. And I don't know. I might need to actually give. I did pull Ric Flair, and I do have the Booker T. But I'll save them for something else. They, they, they're good for food or some shit. Uh, we're we're going to go by rating. And then um, I know I have all, like a lot of Divas, though. So I might just get rid of Divas because I really don't need the Divas. All right, so... We do have Natalia up next. Wait, I want to get yeah, because these four are my main bitches. <laughs> so it's Natalia. I love you. You were great, and uh, we'll get rid of Edge as well. I'll keep the survivors in. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get rid of. We're gonna upgrade the Undertaker. Of course. I'm not going to really miss Natalia at all. I am running out of cards, though. I might need to do some WrestleMania King of the Ring soon. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So, Undertaker is maxed. Ready to go. We'll just combine him right now. Bada bing, bada boom. He's the realest guy in the room. How you doing? And then we'll give him Natalia to max him out one shot. Damn, look at all these fusions. Come on, give me more. I need more. Alright, Natalia. Love you, baby girl, but you're great. And there you go, guys. Undertaker stats. He is the best event WrestleMania card. That's not Fusion. Uh, 4653 in power. 4736 toughness. 4628 in speed. And then 4721 in charisma. So overall, he is a beast of a card. And uh, yeah, I'm pumped to have him as a left arrow. It's pretty awesome. So I'm pumped. I'll lock him up. We'll set him as a champ. Well, exit out the game. Let's see where we are now. I'm sure this guy's be like, whoa. That guy has an Undertaker Pro. <laughs> yes, I do. I really do. I really mean this. Don't hate me for it. So, let's see how we're doing. Uh, yeah, we're going to beat the number one guy, I believe. And Kit. Okay, so this guy's active, but I'll just put in my bench probably and then uh that should do it because i need an ultra rare for tomorrow well is it tomorrow i don't think it's tomorrow but either way i still need an ultra rare card yeah so it'll be important to have an ultra rare card 
Anyways, guys, that will do it for today's episode. We got The Undertaker. You guys heard the news of me getting my new computer in two weeks about, or three weeks. Who knows how long it could be. Cyber Power could be like that. And you guys heard the news of WWE Supercard update coming on Monday. So, brace yourself. What we're going to, well, I'm not sure if it's going to come out on Monday, but we're going to be hearing the talk on Monday. So yeah, it's going to be a crazy week. You know, I got a computer coming. I got SummerSlam weekend that's going to be hitting up next week in New York. It's going to be an overall fun week. Uh, I'm a little sick, so I'm hoping to feel better by then. But anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching the support. Uh, what's it called? I may be doing a giveaway very soon when the new computer comes because I did get free stuff when, it, when the computer comes. And I already own a couple of things, so I might be doing a giveaway on that. Uh, the first giveaway, depending on how they do it, but the first giveaway might be a, a free copy of Counter-Strike Global Offense. I already own the game, and uh, I figured I can give it away to someone who really, really wants it. Uh, so, details on that when it comes in with the new computer. And when it does, then I'll let you guys know, and then we could enter it up. And uh, just so you guys know, for the giveaways that will be coming up, I will be needing you guys to have Twitter. You will need Twitter for the giveaway because it makes it much easier to do besides the whole YouTube thing. It's a pain in the ass when you randomize. Twitter is the overall best solution. I can even record it better on Twitter. So, guys, make sure you have a Twitter for the giveaways for the future. It's coming up. Once again, guys, thank you all so much for everything. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe for more Supercar videos. Follow me on Twitch and Twitter. If you guys want cheap games for, for PC... You know, Microsoft points, PSN codes, cards, iTunes, you name it. Just check out G2A links down below. Get yourself a nice discount. And, uh, yeah, we'll end it there. I will see you guys later. Not sure if I have a video out for Sunday because I will be working 10 hours. Might be too exhausted to make a video. But Monday, definitely we'll have a video. I'll see you guys later.